I really don't matter. I'm just a, a fellow, funny looking fellow of Scottish uh, descent, uh, an elder in uh, the Phoenix Reformed Baptist Church, uh, director of Alpha Omega Ministries. Uh, we're a Christian apologetics organization based in Phoenix and uh, been involved in, well, I started off with Mormonism, uh, was my primary focus. Did a lot of work with them and that expanded out to Jehovah's Witnesses and hence in the area of the Trinity, deity of Christ, things like that. Right. Then I moved into uh, dealing with Roman Catholicism. Uh, we've done over 40 uh, debates with uh, leading Catholic apologists uh, over the years, uh, especially uh, like uh, Mitch Pacwa, uh, the Jesuit uh, scholar who speaks 12 languages. We've had really wow. good debates with him. And so even in the seven years of Greek study that I did before I started teaching language, uh, I come from a long line of uh, Baptist pastors. Uh, so I, I contacted the host and I said, you've got to have somebody on to respond to this stuff. And he says, well, nobody will debate her. She says, nobody will debate her. Uh, well, I said, I will. And I don't know if you've heard the resulting two programs that we had with um, Gail Ripplinger, but they were the last times she ever allowed herself to be uh, put in that in that situation. Right. Uh, it was it was pretty amazing. And uh, I wrote the King James Only Controversy in about four months. Uh, I did six debates against Muslims in South Africa over uh, about seven days. Two of them were in mosques. Uh, four of them were in universities. One of them was actually in the masjid. I stood in front of the Qibla right next to the Mimbar. Mm -hmm. That had never happened in South Africa and to our knowledge hasn't happened in the world in, in our lifetimes. It's just an amazing opportunity to stand there and, and debate. Bayed Bart Ehrman, uh, John Dominic Crossan, Marcus Borg, with all the other fun stuff I get to do, still I think calling to be an elder in the church is, is the highest calling you have. Mm -hmm. And so uh, I've been preaching through Hebrews for three years. Reformed Baptists are known for being very slow preachers anyways. Mm -hmm. Beware of false prophets which come to you in sheep's clothing, but inwardly they are ravening wolves. Many will say to me in that day, Lord, Lord, have we not prophesied in thy name? And in thy name have cast out devils? And in thy name done many wonderful works? And then will I profess unto them, I never knew you. Depart from me, ye that work iniquity.